Zippy's battery is dead. And my winder's not working. So Dave's going to have to put a new battery in Zippy. And it's 94 degrees out. Oh boy. We're Dave and Karen from Watts on Wheels and we sold our sticks and bricks to RV full time now that we are retired. We travel with our heavy duty truck Leroy, our two k motorcycles, our DRV Dixie and our smart car Zippy. Don't forget to subscribe and click on that bell to be notified when we post a new video. And Dave's going to do it himself. And that's where it's located. Under the feet of the passenger. Under the floorboard. So you found a replacement battery at O'Reilly's? Yep. And they actually had one in stock? They did. So this battery's been operating for seven years. And it just started doing this and then nothing. The nothing. So it's time. First, we take off the negative terminal. We want that off. Then we have to loosen up the battery here. The battery mount. You ever changed one of these before? Nope. Always something new to Not learn. Not on a smart car. Yeah, I never expected it to be underneath the passenger's feet. <laughs> I see on that floorboard you have a little, was it a tire blow-up kit? Yeah. And also, if you need to reattach to the front where they are, import these, they have that ring that's attached to the front of the bumper. Okay. Tie them down. Tie yes. down for shipping. So if you want to do a tie down for shipping, there you go. But I didn't know that stuff was in there. So that, that's all underneath the little styrofoam floorboard. Or perhaps if you got to pull the car out of something. Yeah. You're stuck and uh -huh. need to pull. Yeah. I can't even roll down the windows, can I? No. Nope. Of course, it's another 90, 90, 90, 90 degree. Plus. <laughs> and we did get Zippy a window shade, and that fits perfectly. There it goes. Oh, that's attached to the cable. Oh, convenient. There we go. What size is that one? 10 millimeters. There we go. Now we had to... What's going on here? But this thing has to come out of there. Wax? Yeah. Surely don't make it easier like a easy like a regular car. No. I sure don't. There it goes. I gotta figure out how to get this thing out of the hole. Yowza. Yeah, say the word. Providing a little bit of shade. Oh, keep the umbrella right there. 
That helps, doesn't it? It does. Right, put the new battery in the hole. What did that one cost you? A hundred and fifty some odd dollars. That's ridiculous. 159 bucks. Yeah. They get you on these little cars. Yeah, that's a stroking. And then we hook up this little vent. A little tube. tube. Yeah. Is there an order that you have to reattach it? Yeah, same way I took it apart. <laughs> yeah, you want to put the the uh, hot terminal on first. You leave the ground for the last. Let's make sure this is as difficult as we could make it. Give me a little slack for crying out loud. Gonna have to go swimming after this cool down and give your back a rest. Take this on there. Put the lock nut back on. Yep. So that terminal is connected then, right? Yep. And that's the positive? Yep. Oh, make a noise. Yep. Okay, get your test start. Oh, that's what you want to hear. Any dummy lights? Got a little, sure. You got to get an oil change. I know that. They got the little wrenches going on, but no other dummy lights. All right. It's 94 degrees out. That's good. Okay, now you get to put all this stuff back. Are you going to need yeah, some zip ties first? first? Zip tie. I want you to know that this is three beers plus one just because it's hot out. Okay. And I've got to kneel down. Yeah, understood. If anybody has a smart car and their battery goes dead, they would have to take this all apart to get to that to jump it. you got to pull the floorboard up, yeah. Yeah. But that's where it's at. That's where it's at. That alone's kind of a pain in the butt because you got to open up your door and somebody's going to have to come aside of you and have a really long set of jumps. Set of jumps, unless you have one of those jump kits. Jump box, yeah. Mm -hmm. Put the floorboard back in. I got to figure out how I did that. I had no idea where the battery was. And then this one. And then there's one more that goes right here. All done? All done. You thirsty? Give me some, where's the beer lady? <laughs>
Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up. We'd love to hear from you in the comments below, even if it's just to say hi. Don't forget to subscribe.